So a clinical supervisee comes to you expressing a particular prejudice about a client's lifestyle, sexuality, gender, religion, skin color, whatever it is. How would you work with that as a clinical supervisor? Well, as a supervisor, first of all, I would want to make sure that he's not seeing those particular people. If 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 mm -hmm. one has a prejudice about a particular culture, race, uh, would you trust that therapist to, to see those people as, as, as their clients? And I think that shouldn't happen. And, and the, 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 the therapist really needs to go and work about those prejudices. It is one of those elements that you sometimes do pick up when people come in because oh, yes and sometimes it's unconscious they don't even know they're carrying mm. these prejudices do they talk normally like like they are right in what they're saying and it it, 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 it materializes that it's prejudice when you begin to question them about it mm. Mm. question their jokes question their statements that they've said their, 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 their beliefs and if if you are if you have prejudices then then you should be careful whom to see for therapy mm. 